launch. And there goes the second tower, so we are 15 seconds away from launch. We're going to see the boosters at the bottom light up, and as their thrust builds, it'll eventually overcome. Just idiot. We're on that. Have you on? Made one. And lift off. Cassidy, even Eichen, and Wagner on their way to the International Space Station. Fifteen seconds into the flight, all parameters are nominal. We confirm on board, all parameters are nominal. Twenty seconds into launch, um, thrusters are working nominally. The crew is feeling fine. 30 seconds. All parameters for the vehicle are nominal. The crew is feeling fine. 40 seconds into flight. Thrusters are working nominally and the vehicle is nominal. Getting good continuous calls from the crew and the ground. Everything with the vehicle looking nominal. The first stage powering the Soyuz upward delivering 930,000 pounds of thrust from the four strap-on boosters in that single core engine. Roll and yaw at 60 minutes into flight. The yaw pitch roll, the attitude or which way it's pointing, we're hearing all those parameters or the status of it, nominal. 70 seconds into flight. Everything's fine with the vehicle on our side. We can affirm we're feeling good. Again, this first stage going to continue to burn for just about two minutes into the flight. So just under a minute to go on the first stage. Ninety seconds. In the flight, our thrusters are working nominally. We confirm, and we're feeling well on board. So he's continuing to retreat and review. Already traveling well in excess of 100, 1,100 miles per hour. We confirm. And seeing the Koryov cross there as those strap-on boosters separate, the first stage separating right on time. We also confirm lateral unit separation. Their job done, they drop weight at an altitude of about 28 statute miles. The Soyuz traveling at about 3,300 miles an hour. Vehicle stabilization is nominal. Everything's fine on board. with the first stage in the launch escape tower now jettison being powered by that second stage the core stage we confirm the jettisoning of the no the trout jettison and getting some views now from the Soyuz spacecraft itself looking back towards the Soyuz rocket you have a solar array right in front of your view there the launch shroud has been jettisoned, so the Soyuz spacecraft now exposed. 70 seconds into flight, the vehicle is fine, and we are feeling well on board. This is Arcute. Everything looking good with that core stage. The second stage, 90 minutes. 56 feet in length, 13 and a half in diameter, has a single engine with four fuel chambers, provides between 178,000 and 222,000 pounds of thrust, depending on their altitude, for its three minutes and 28 seconds of operation. Again, the second stage is going to continue to burn. We're looking for second stage shutdown at about four minutes, 30 seconds after launch. Parameters of the vehicle are nominal. We confirm we are feeling well. Two hundred and thirty seconds into flight, the vehicle is stable. We copy and we confirm everything is um, nominal on board. So we're a little over four minutes since launch. Again, we'll be looking for that shutdown and separation coming up in about 20 seconds. And as that separation occurs, the third stage will begin firing. It's called a hot stage technique. And that third stage will ignite while the second is still attached. And standing by for second stage shutdown. Yes. 
We confirm separation of stage two. We see it as well. Everything's nominal on board. Copy. And we have confirmation second stage shutdown had separated and you saw a piece fly off. That was the third stage's lower skirt jettison. That was targeted to come off at four minutes, 56 seconds into launch. We're already past five minutes and 20 seconds. Third stage now going to continue to burn until we're at our orbital insertion. So the initial orbit of the Soyuz spacecraft that's expected uh, to come in about eight minutes and 46 seconds of, at shutdown. And then the separation coming just four seconds later. Into flight, and the thrusters are working nominally. We confirm, and everything's nominal on board. So right now, the Soyuz being propelled into orbit by the single engine of the third stage, providing 67,000 pounds of thrust, and going to continue to burn until shutdown. Coming in just under three minutes from now. 300, 360 seconds into flight. Your pitch and roll are all nominal. Copy, and we are feeling well on board. Still getting great updates from the crew. Anatoly Evanation talking to the ground. Everyone feeling well on board. Yaw pitch roll. The engines all performing nominally. That's the word we want to keep hearing. It means everything's going normally according to the plan. Six minutes, 35 seconds since liftoff. 390 seconds into flight. All control systems uh, for the vehicle are working nominally. And we confirm we are fine on board. Copy. Four hundred and twenty seconds into flight, your pitch and roll parameters are all nominal. Copy. We are fine on board. And we just passed seven minutes and 30 seconds into this flight. Spacecraft velocity right around 13,500 miles an hour. Confirm, Irkude inaudible. We copy Irkude. Four hundred and seventy seconds into flight. Third stage thrusters are working nominally. Everything's well on board. Four hundred and ninety seconds into flight. The vehicle is stable. And we're standing by. Our next major milestone is going to be the shutdown of that third stage coming in about twenty seconds from now. On board. Thank you for your support. 510 seconds into flight, your pitch and roll are all nominal. Get ready for the stage separation. So we'll see the engines cut off, and once the vehicle separates, it usually gives the crew a bit of a jolt. Then the Soyuz will be flying free. We see the third stage separating there. And we can see it dropping away now. Third stage separation confirmed. And congratulations, guys. You are in orbit. I am handing you over to the Mission Control Moscow. As we can see on the video here, that solar array deployed. We have confirmation that the one on the other side also deployed, along with what's known as the appendages, all of the antennas, so the rendezvous and the communication antennas all deployed on the Soyuz spacecraft. Then we will be standing by for um, the first measurement, and then please proceed to page 39. Я Иркут-2. Готов дать первый замер. 
MCC Moscow, this is Irkuri 2. I am ready to give you. I am ready. So we'll stick with these views in the Soyuz as long as we still have them. They'll begin passing uh, out of the range of the ground stations where we're able to get this video transmitted.